today's Get Dirty segment, we're talking about growing your own roots and spices that are good for your health. This morning, Kathleen Yoshinaga with the Hawaii Floriculture and Nursery Association joins us this morning with tips. Good morning, Kathleen. Good morning. Okay, so happy to have you because I know nothing about roots oh, and growing them. It's really, really simple. Okay, and you make everything so simple. So no, it's even simpler than that. All right, Ginger, turmeric, garlic can be grown in your own. All you need is a good soil mix, uh, equal parts of potting soil, compost, and maybe vermiculite to, uh, for a lot of good drainage. You just stick a piece of it into a soil, and about nine months later, voila, with ginger, you're ready. That's it. it. You That's just it. put and it in of the course, ground? Put it in the ground, water it, of course. And this is how much ginger last week I harvested out of this pot already. And there's about two more big segments left. And you want to get in there and try to take a look? Sure. I've never I mean, done this before. I just I, dig? Usually, yep, just dig. Oh, so this well, is, yeah, I left one here. And there's a, one more big piece under this. This thing one? Where, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right there, if you just I'm dig. afraid to chop no, it no, up no, in don't half. Worry. It's okay. I'm just going to lift this with the leaf. Is. Oh. Okay, let's see. And there we go. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sorry. Okay. That was my fault. So, so that's about it. And then after that, you have to clean it off. And then you're. It it's smells so good. It. it already smells yeah. like you can I eat know. it. I let this dry about a week after I cleaned it off. And the same thing with turmeric. I'm making sure it's, I didn't leave anything behind. No, I think we're good. That's about it. Because okay. I, other than that, it's just some small, you know, bit butt pieces. But you know, this is great. And you know, from yeah. here, you can do a lot with it. You know, ginger has all these wonderful properties on it. It is, it has ginger rolls, which is a potent anti-inflammatory. So you want to use it as a germ fighter. It's an immune booster, and it also relieves uh, motion sickness. Oh, really? That's why you see a lot of ginger candy for people, because it helps ah. seasickness, motion sickness. That's that makes great. sense. Okay, and when you plant it, how long mm. does it take after you okay, stick it in? It's a long time. It's about oh, yeah. nine to ten months. And in between all that, I had a lot of leaves in it. I had a flower in it. But eventually, you know it's ready and th big enough when the flower and plant actually starts dying. Ah, I had okay. more leaves, but it actually died, and I waited for this. And that's when it's ready? Yeah. So when you that's stuck when it in, because this is pretty big, how big was it when you stuck this in? Just a little smidgen piece. A tiny about, bit. But, yeah. Just oh. a little. From here, maybe I can replant it. Only about, about an inch piece it was. That's impressive. Yeah. And then same thing with garlic. You know, this is from purchased garlic, and it, I looked for something that had a little sprout on it already. And this garlic here is actually after one wait let me just get this out here this is oh one my. week worth okay oh that's so that's how quick. It, yeah it's pretty quick but it takes about six months or so and for that what did you do just put in one clove? Uh, same thing yeah just one little clove oh. off of the garlic and i wet it overnight and then i stuck it in there oh. and that's it Kathy, and, i'm gonna be real I didn't and then know. garlic leaves by the way it'll have a shoot out a lot of leaves yeah you yeah can which cut this them is off. starting to do yeah it's delicious you know use it for stir fries and just like you know season like onions you just use it it just has a great wow. interesting flavor Okay, and Tumor I'm going to be real, Kathleen. I didn't even know garlic was grown underground. Oh, okay, yeah. well, so it's how... a bulb, yes, it's a bulb. <laughs> that's how much I'm learning today, and it's so easy. Yeah, it's very easy, and this is a turmeric, and I'm going to start this, but this one didn't really start yet. This one's been a week, and turmeric's a little slower. It's just okay. like garlic, but it's a little... But same thing, you just one. pop it down. Yeah, you just pop it down and wait for the roots to come out and then transplant it, and before you know it, you'll have a whole hunk of it. You know, of all days. Wow. It's really fast. It's about seven months, though. Mm -hmm. But, you know, no care. You know, pretty much just make sure the soil is wet off and on. And that's it. That's it. That's it. You're blowing my mind today, Kathleen. Okay. Now, with that, you know, ginger rolls it has great things for you. Um, turmeric is even better, by the way. It lowers your cholesterol, aids in digestion, and it's also a natural analgesic. It helps coughs. You know, mm. it really helps your cough. And, the, and one of the things also about turmeric is it aids in weight management. Oh, all right, give it here. <laughs> well, really, it, it's a fat, you know, metabolizer or something like that. And so but you it, brought something for us I today. I made tea, okay? Uh -huh. With this ginger batch here, I made you some tea. Aww. And all you do is slice it up, clean uh -huh. it, slice it up, and put it into, uh, actually, with hot boiling water, and just let it sit for about 20 to 30 minutes. And you have a tea that you can drink now, hot or cold. Beautiful. So I made this last Aww. night, and I warmed it up Thank this you. morning. Ooh, so yes, know, nice and toasty. All right, well, cheers. cheers. Thanks so much, Kathleen. All right, let's see. Oh, and it's good. Well, okay, this one, you can also add honey. But this is mm. just plain. It doesn't need it. And ginger. 
I like so, it. Yeah, and it's really easy to drink. And it, you know what? I took it last week because I had a cold. And, and I currently have my cough. At, so yeah, I cough at night, right? Mm -hmm. it, for me, it just was. It just drink it at night. That's it. Perfect. Cough that's all you need. Away. Well, thank you so much, Kathleen, for joining us and for these awesome tips.